This week, Android at Mobile World Congress, Nokia Music Plus, and more. This is the Mobile Nation's Monday Brief. Greetings, mobile delegates. I'm Ashley Esqueda, and you're tuned in to the Mobile Nation's Monday Brief. It's time for Mobile World Congress, and Android Central is in full force over in Barcelona, Spain, to bring the Android Nation news of what devices, apps, and gadgets are coming your way. Two big players made unveiling choices outside of MWC, with HTC already showing off their One, and Samsung rumored to show off the Galaxy S4 sometime after the conference, but there's still tons to see and talk about on the show floor. Android Central has a full rundown up, letting you know what to expect from all of the major players at the show. Sony will usually show off mid-range devices, Samsung will reveal the long-rumored 8-inch Galaxy Note tablet, and LG will show the Optimus G Pro. Those aren't the only companies making a splash at MWC, though, so keep your browsers pointed at AndroidCentral.com this week to keep up with all the shiny new Androidness. I more realized last week that the iPad mini turned a whole four months old. And to celebrate, each of iMore's editors and our very own Derek Kessler posted their take on how the iPad mini has changed their lives. Oddly enough, each editor had a different case study from Leanna Lofty completely replacing her full-size iPad with the mini to our very own lovely redhead Georgia deciding there just wasn't any room in her life for it at all. It's an interesting read if you're curious to see longer term reactions to the iPad mini, especially because they're pretty honest about using or not using them. Hit up imore.com for more details, and while you're there, read up on and enter the contest to win a colorful iPad mini from AnnoStyle by clicking on that fancy contest button in the upper right hand part of the screen. Crackberry's story is short but sweet this week. If you picked up a BlackBerry Z10 and you're coming from a BB7 device like the 9900, you probably want to transfer all that data you have sitting on it to your new phone. So it's pretty easy to do with BlackBerry Link and Crackberry.com's Adam Zeiss has a tidy little tutorial walking you through the process. There are also lots of good tips in the comments section on that post from folks who have already done this transfer, so high fives all around, Crackberry Nation. Windows Phone Central let its readership know that Nokia Music Plus is now available for all Nokia Lumias in the USA. It'll cost you $3.99 a month for a subscription, but there's a lot to love about what Nokia is offering. You'll get everything the regular free Nokia Music app offers to Lumia owners, plus unlimited downloads for offline listening, unlimited song skips, a sound quality boost, and more. If you want to grab it, just open up your Nokia Music app on your Lumia phone, and you should see an option in the settings to upgrade to Music Plus. Now, fortunately for you Lumia owners who aren't quite sure if you want to subscribe, Nokia is offering a free seven-day trial so you can check it out. Head over to WPCentral.com for all the details, and let us know if you end up subscribing. Lastly, a totally weird story from WebOS Nation, one that was so good, we saved it from the week before last. Chubby Checker, the musician who popularized the song The Twist back in 1960, is suing Hewlett Packard and Pong? So it's gotta be some kind of image use or copyright infringement, right? Well, kind of. You see, a long time ago, there used to be an app in the WebOS app catalog called The Chubby Checker. It wasn't used to teach you how to do the twist, though. It was an app that would calculate a guy's size based on the size of his shoe. Yeah, it gets weirder. Mr. Checker is suing for, get ready for it, half a billion dollars with a B. Considering this app probably made less than a couple hundred bucks while it was available, well, good luck there, chubby. Let us know how it goes for you. If you want to read all of Derek's hilarious rant about the case and all the details on it, hit up webosnation.com. I promise it's worth the visit. That's it for your Mobile Nations Monday Brief. You can subscribe to our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash mobile nations. Check out our dazzling and informative podcasts at mobilenations.com slash shows. And you can follow me on Twitter at Ashley Eskeva. Nations, you have been briefed.